Welcome to the Wednesday, May 28th, 2014 edition of Erner Berry's Daily Video, sponsored by Moark Eggs. In today's show, we recap the latest cold storage figures for Turkey. Plus, Preferred Freezer Services finds its car among the leaders during last weekend's Indy 500. But first, a competitive bid could derail Hillshire Brands' bid for Pinnacle Foods. Here with the story is your host, Jamie Chadwick. The nation's number two chicken producer, Pilgrim's Pride, made a $6.4 billion unsolicited bid on Tuesday for rival meat processor Hillshire Brands, likely killing off Hillshire's $4.3 billion bid for Pinnacle Foods. Pilgrim's offered $45 a share in cash for Hillshire's, whose brands include Jimmy Dean Sausages and Ballpark Franks. Pilgrim's Pride said its proposal has the unanimous support of the company's board, as well as majority owner Brazilian meat packer JBS. The offer includes a $163 million termination fee payable to Pinnacle. Pilgrim said it expects the deal would close in the third quarter of this year. Hillshire Brands issued a statement in response to the proposal by Pilgrim's saying that the Hillshire Brands board will thoroughly review the Pilgrim's Pride proposal. Subscribers can track Pilgrim's proposal along with other company news from the center of the plate at foodmarket.com. In other news, we break down the latest developments in frozen turkey supplies with poultry market reporter Terrence Wells. The release of the April 30th monthly freezer report last week gave fodder for discussion to a turkey industry absent from the Memorial Day spotlight. Like with the March report, the data revealed what is obvious to buyers and sellers. Holdings in each of the major categories continue to fall below 2013. In most cases, year-on-year -year declines are well into the double digits. Since the last report, whole body toms, breasts, and mechanically deboned meat have distanced themselves even further from 2013's levels. Hands and legs have given back a little but holding are still well below 12 months prior. Perhaps most significant this time around is the 34 million pound decrease exhibited by whole body toms. In a current industry environment where boneless meat is king, it isn't surprising that processors don't have a lot of toms available or that they would debone them at every opportunity. In the meantime, total turkey holdings are 18% or more than 2,000 truckloads below last year, creating an at times uncomfortably snug supply side market situation. Thanks, Terrence. We wrap up today's show with SeafoodNews.com staff writer Michael Ramsing recapping Preferred Freezer Services' successful day at the races. Preferred Freezer Services caught some national exposure over the weekend as Indy race car driver Jerry Hildebrand powered the company's number 21 Chevrolet to a top 10 finish during the 98th running of the Indianapolis 500. The car, sponsored by Preferred and part of the Ed Carpenter Racing Team, spent most of the day in the top 10, climbing to as high as third place in the 200 lap event, known as the greatest spectacle in racing. But a tire issue forced Hildebrand, who was driving Preferred's car for the first time, to stop for repairs, which resulted in a 10th place finish. 2000, the 2011 Indy 500 Rookie of the Year added that Preferred's car was fast, a pleasure to drive, and could have competed with the leaders were it not for the tire issue. The racing team will be in Detroit this weekend for the series' next race, but there are no indications Preferred's Chevy will compete in the event. Thanks, Michael. That concludes today's video. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you tomorrow. This broadcast is sponsored by Moark Eggs. For more than 50 years, Moark has grown their business with a commitment to adding real value to their products and services, providing old-fashioned customer service that is tested and proven to meet your needs. Visit them online at www.moarkllc.com or give them a call at 866-757-EGGS.